All right, here we go. This is an impact mill I built. Um, I've been in the process for a couple of years. It's not running yet. <clears throat> Actually, it is running, but there's interference. A uh, little interference I need to uh, fix inside. It's chain driven uh, by a 55 horse Polaris. Uh, plenty of power. I can do a PTO off the end of it. Coming from here over to here, these legs. I can put a couple of bearings on the legs and run something else if I want. It's three times the power it needs. Automatic chain adjuster. Um, it's got three bearings. Um, I'll post another video when it's all ready to run. It clanks around right now because the internals are... Uh, I mismeasured just a little bit. Actually, I, mis I measured perfectly, but when, uh, when we welded some of it, uh, it shrunk the frame in a little bit when we welded the plates inside, the wear plates. So uh, there was a 16th uh, no, there's a, I'm sorry, there's a 32nd of an inch clearance, and now in one spot there's zero clearance, so it's just hitting just a little bit. I don't have guards on it. I started putting a guard over here is a pretty good one. Got to put the end on it here and then go underneath with the guard. Uh, these belts get pretty nasty when they break take your arm off so I didn't want to have any problems like that but uh, that's that's basically it for now uh, everything's coming together I'm gonna be posting videos um, fairly shortly of the whole operation I got my jaw crusher in place uh, I got my crush sight uh, almost done uh, with water circulation and stuff and I will be posting videos on the on the operation of it all. So anyway, stay tuned. Thank you.